Warpugs. So, this takes place just after the last one that we checked out from GG, and that was the horse and the infant. So this uh, this particular scene takes place immediately after that. Now, I would like to thank Hannah. Hannah, thank you for sending me a good playlist, so I'll be able to keep track of it. She said there was a lot of like a lot of things going on here, but much appreciated, Hannah, for sending that through to me. Now. Um, if I look like I've been sweating, I have been. Guys, um, I have been, I just got back down from hiking. Um, I'm very, very happy right now. Um, me and the hospital are just spent about an hour and 15 minutes in the woods and just roaming around doing stuff. Um, I'm dropping weight, a lot of weight, relatively quickly. Um, I'm, I'm exceptionally, I'm exceptionally happy about that. Um, and I'm hoping to continue doing that. We're going to be trying to do this uh, every uh, every other day or every day. We're going to be trying to do this. Um, it's going to be be largely dependent on her. She's in she's in more need to be in sh uh, to you know get in shape than I am. But uh, it's going to depend largely on her because I always have stuff to do. <laughs> but war pugs, this is just a man, and if this. I already have high expectations because so far um, those expectations have been surpassed every time. So we're going to jump into this animic. Uh, Anna, Anna, I can't speak English. You know what I'm talking about. War Pugs, leave a like, subscribe. Definitely subscribe to Gigi. Let's get into it. I stopped recording for a second there because I honestly thought that I had done something wrong. Because I had no sound. Here we go. I look into your eyes and I think back to the sun. He's through these actions haste my days every man I've slain is the price I pay endless pain. Close your eyes and spare yourself the few. How could I hurt you? I'm just a man who's trying. But when does a comet become a meteor? When does a candle become a blaze? When does a man become a monster? When does a ripple become a tidal oh wave? When does the reason become the blame? When does a man become a monster? Dude. This is too heavy, man. This is too heavy. 
Sorry, I'm sweating like crazy, guys. I just got... I literally walked to and sat down to watch this. This is too heavy. First off... Number one, the song in and of itself speaks on so many ungodly levels to me and I assume every veteran out there that would watch this who's ever been, you know, who's ever been or seen anything, anybody that's ever really seen things in their life would watch this and feel a certain kind of way. Like, definitely feel a certain kind of way. In fact, if you have, like, th between this one and the last one, if you have a veteran in your family, I would recommend showing them this just to see how they perceive it. Because this, for me, speaks on so many stupid amounts of levels. The lyrics themselves are really excessively powerful. And especially... When he's when he's talking about trying, to, the only thing he wants to do is get back to his wife Penelope and his son. But at the same time, he knows what he has to do. He knows what he is supposed to do. Uh, this scene, this one right here, was the best part. Was the absolute best part. The symbolism of the tree sprouting from the from the child. That is basically talking about from this single seed will come the destruction of everything that you love, as you know, he was he was warned in the last episode. Um God, there's so much here. But this is the worst part. This is the worst part because you know he's going to do it. And the bad thing about it is, he's going to do this, and then he's going to have to live with it. He's Back then, you didn't allow anyone to live that could raise a sword and, and seek vengeance. You just didn't do it. And this is what the God specifically forewarned him about in, in, with this child, was... Because this child would destroy everything that he ever held dear if he allowed it to live. <sighs> War Pugs, I'm telling you, this series is pro is is just simply put amazing. Um, the sketch artwork, the sketch style artwork here, actually sells it better, I think, than a full blown animation. Because there's a lot that your mind can really envision. But this scene right here, where, and I'm just going to let it play, where he looks at himself in the mirror and sees himself become something different. Um, I think every single adult can attest to having some sort of feeling like this at some point in their life when they were they're faced with a decision. Not Now, granted, not nearly as severe as this, but a decision nonetheless that's going to cost them. It's going to cost them something. Something in the neighborhood of how they view themselves, how others might view them. Warpugs, I'm going to keep on with this. This is an amazing series. This, the music is ungodly good and paired with the visuals. It's ma it's absolutely magnificent. Warpugs, I'm going to take off. Be sure to like and comment, subscribe. GG's links in the description down below right next to my own. Check out the new house, new house wish list, if you will. I need, to get a, I need to get like a camel back or something. And I'll catch you guys next time.